the overnights. It was pretty interesting. No, I came out with a cuticle conditioning cream, so it's a moisturizer for use uh, daily. The BBC for Barbara Brown cuticle. And I watched one of the Texas Chainsaw Massacres. I think it was a Texas Chainsaw Massacre 3. I don't know, but it was terrible. I was like, I've never seen such a bad version of Texas Chainsaw. I felt bad. Yeah, it was really bad. I think Trey Songs was in it too. And then I saw... What was the other movie I watched? Oh, Spawn! Let me know in the comments below if you guys have ever seen Spun. That is a very interesting movie. So I'm using the diamond prep right now to go in and really gently remove the shine off the natural nail and also help us further remove the crusty molestes on the phalange. Are you guys loving this lighting? We have like so many lights centered on us, it's not even funny. How many do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six. Like six or seven lamps on us. I'm so obsessed with lighting. It was, it was so bad. Which nails, love? The one, mine? I don't take them off. I just buff them down, and then I do a fill with um, with our gels. And I have videos on how I do my own nails as well too. So you should check them out on how to remove them and properly take care of them. So now we're gonna go in with a little coat of nail prep. to cleanse and dehydrate the nail bed and the dry non-living tissue surrounding it. Hi love, thanks for joining us today. You guys, if we reach 100 views, we're gonna do a giveaway. You wanna pick a winner, winner chicken dinner, Eliana Vieira? Eliana is actually a newer model. She works here at inocouture.com. And uh, I was like, who wants to be a model today? And she's like, me. <laughs> Both. It's up to you. Oh, we're at 102. <gasps> that was fast. We're gonna do a giveaway today. So you have to stick with us till the end of the video in order to be a winner. And then Eliana Rivera is gonna pick a winner, winner chicken dinner. Antonia was her last winner. And uh, she has a little prize going out today. She'll be getting it hopefully before the end of the week. A little knickknack, a little trinket, a little thingamabob. For the fantasy. Oh well, thanks for watching us today. I appreciate that. And we're gonna use the brand new bubble gum gel in pink. And as you guys already know, bubble gum gel is vegan, hypoallergenic, and chemo-free. So we're gonna scoop a little bit out. <laughs> Antonia, have you seen Spun? But I'm so sad. Usually, today, I would be on a plane going to Disney World. Because you guys know I always go to Disney World in January. But this year, because we're short-staffed here at inocouture.com, uh, it's harder for me to leave the office. We always do our class too in January, and this year I can't because well, Marissa she's on baby on maternity leave, and then April, who's our new um, office staff, she was not able to come in today because she was feeling ill. So you can, but because this is a really fast get them in, get them out application, we are skipping that part altogether, and I've done that with. Um, both press on gel and with DIY gel. Yes, I saw that uh, yesterday. No, Christmas Eve, Christmas Eve, New Year's Eve, New Year's Day for the first time. That movie is uh, a trip. 
Oh, and then yesterday I saw Boys Don't Cry. That movie was so sad. Have you ever heard of that? It's really sad. That's why we prep and prime prior. Make sure it's not crooked. Yeah, Boys Don't Cry is really super sad. It's about, um, she's a... She's a transgender woman, so she a transgender man. So it, it was a born female, but she was transitioning to, um, to be a man, and um, she gets raped and murdered. This is a solid glue so Yes, and you can also visit the website and look at all the product descriptions. And we have over ten thousand videos, so that way you can decide which um, adhesive is going to work best for you. Because that's the great thing about our product is we have such a huge variety. A product, so there's something that's gonna work perfect for you, given your needs and wants and circumstances. Three triple A. Yes, all of our products are meant to be used in conjunction with each other and not be mixed. Because then, if you do that, you're gonna get problems. I'm using my finger, you guys. This, that is a revolution. Oh, and then I saw another movie. That black comedy called um, Who's Your Daddy with Elijah Wood. Oh, yeah. It's, have you ever seen Fargo? No. <gasps> You've never seen Fargo? Oh my gosh, that movie is so good. It's like that same kind of style, like that dark humor. Fargo is about a man that um, he's married to this like lady who her dad is really rich and he stages a, he stages a kidnapping, but it goes really wrong. Look at that! Like literally, they're done, you guys. So fast and easy. Let's go ahead and pick that for one minute. And it's a comedy. It doesn't sound like a comedy, but it's funny. Really, really well made too. And we're gonna use our fantastic file in 150 today to blend in these nails. What do you guys think of the bubblegum gel? Isn't it fabulous? Let's take a really quick look at our other hand. And this is the one we did on Instagram. Like, doesn't that look like a sculpted full set, you guys? It's beautiful. What else did I do? Oh, I went on Pottery Barn because I ordered some Mickey Mouse like bedding. Oh my gosh. So they have Potter Tube, they have Pottery Barn, they have PB Teen, and then they have Pottery Barn Kids. And I had to order off three different websites to get the things I wanted. Like, it's the same company, but three different websites. It's like if I had three different websites selling the same stuff. And I was like, oh my gosh, it's confusing. And they're expensive. Are they? Yeah, Potter Tube Water is really expensive. But I got the stuff on sale. And it, I mean, it wasn't that much cheaper, but like, I'm gonna have Mickey Mouse bed sheets. Yeah. They're Christmas because they, they were on sale. Start to That's why you apply prep and primer. You don't if you don't prep the nail properly, anything can lift. That's why you have to follow all the steps prior. That's why nail preparation is the most important part. So now I'm going to customize the shape, make sure it fits like a glove. Hema, yes. All of our products are Hema free. And they're made in America. Somebody on Instagram or was it here had asked if I sit on a yoga mat, an acupuncture mat, and the answer is yes, I do. So fascinating. Yes, and I have videos on how to do feels too. We have over 10,000 videos in our social media library, so you're gonna have to binge watch. Like you're binge watching The Real Housewives. Oh, and Why Swap, I like that show too. I like the Australian version. I don't understand, what do you mean? (laughs) 
Let's blend in the cuticle using the tower top bits. And we're gonna blend in, make everything nice and smooth and flawless in the back. Being careful there. That was there prior to me doing the nail though, so. For very, very gravity cuticles. And take better care of your hands, especially in our weather. Super drying. Yeah, because our air is super dry here. We have no humidity, no precipitation. Let's go in and blend, 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 blend. Focus it, Yoli. Did you go party, Yoli? You did it, but you love partying. Parting is safe. Yes, I'm, we're live right now. Say hi to everybody, Yogi. Hi. <laughs> maybe, maybe this week? When's your birthday? Oh, that's right. I think I should be able to squeeze you in this week. April, um, she was she called out sick today, so. These are almond, yeah, and they're ombre. So that she's gonna go to Bojangles later. <laughs> she's actually she said she's never been to Bojangles. Can you believe that? Everybody's been to Bojangles. That's where you go. That's the spot. He's doing okay. He's doing okay. He's not dead, so. Betty Davis. Betty Davis died in the 80s. Betty White was 99 years old. She almost made it. So 100. But uh, to be honest with you, I was never a fan of Betty White. Really? Yeah, I don't get it. I, ne I never watched the Golden Girls. Maybe that's why. You watch the Golden Girls? I mean, everybody has to go. She was 99 years old. But I know some people love Betty White. You could get the magic remover, but you have to file it and then soak, or acetone. You can get some pure acetone and then soak them in, in a like a glass bowl or a metal bowl, and then I'll have to uh, take them off too. I'm sorry. I would probably use um because you don't have a file, or if you do have a file. File them with like a really coarse file and then put the magic remover on, and then it takes about maybe like 20 minutes. So now we're gonna add nail prep over everything. Well, your nails came out pretty too. You know who has really pretty nails too? Yes. Oh my gosh, wow. We have a winner. Huh? You get your nails done for free. Must be nice. So why do I apply nail prep over the French or the ombre nails? And that is because the French and the ombre nails are hand painted. So you do not apply, you do not buff the top surface of the nail because that will lead to removal of the design, which is the French or the ombre. And that goes for the, both the black and the white nails. So now we're gonna take diamond gel and we're gonna bling out her ring finger. Excited. I forgot. I ordered something from Birdoff Goodman. Press that number four if you like shopping at Birdoff Goodman. And it arrived today. Remember I was telling you about that really like fancy perfume that a lot of people are talking about on TikTok? The Baccarat Rouge. I ordered it. I should get it today. Like a uh, French hooker from like the 1800s. Oh, 
look at that one. So stunning. So the rhinestones that we're using, of course we're using our diamond sorting tray. And the stones are from the crystals for your nails. Flat back series. It actually kind of smells like the Ari Ariana Grande perfume. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But the Ariana Grande one, I bought it, it doesn't last. Really? Not, well, not on me. But I have really strong... I don't have, like, I don't want to say VO, but, like, I have really strong body chemistry. Because my dad is part Middle Eastern. Yeah. So, they have a very different body chemical composition. So we need, like, really strong perfumes in order to get into, like, that. But I like smelling pretty so. I used to have one girl that used to work in, she's like, every time I walk by you, you always smell so nice. And I was like, oh, thank you. I still fired her, though. Do you think I smell nice? Or you can't smell me? What do I smell like? Like a rich. Oh my gosh. Like an old lady. Which one am I wearing today? Oh, I'm wearing um, Red Poppy from Jumbo It was a special edition one for Chinese New Year. Mm -hmm. I will see you hopefully this week, Yoni. So that will be good. Are you, you're gonna um, dance on camera. You guys, Yoni, every time she posts a video of her dancing, you gotta give it a like because she can shake it. Oye, mujer, solo quiero darte un beso. I will. No, call, for sure, probably, I hope uh, this week, if April comes. De comer? I'm gonna diet, Yoli. Trying to get skinny. Oh, borscht! Borscht is Ukrainian or Russian soup made out of feta village. Yeah, and they're good for um, what do you call iron, too. And the other thing I like a lot too is lentils. Yeah, but I don't like lentils Mexican style. No, I don't like American style. Um, Indian or African are really good. You have to try them Ethiopian style. They're so good. If you guys have ever tried um, Ethiopian food, the lentil soup they make, the bomb.com. No, it's so good. It's spicy though. A little spicy, a little spicy. Some African soup, so good. Bye, Yoli. Huh? It's called the bling tool. <laughs> really? You should try the African way that they cook lentils. It's so good. Cause I don't like lentils like how like my mom makes them, yeah. but African or like um, Indian style they're so good. Yeah. That's good. Okay, let's go ahead and bake that just thirty seconds. Yes, and I have videos on filling them with a cook. And then we're gonna use some Dom Top to feel everything and make it nice and shiny. Because this is a thick gel, so beautiful. Karen, so I'm trying to get into the lentils, but the texture is weird. Really? For lentils? It's like a, like a bean or a pea, but a little bit more firm. Really? Uh huh. They're high in fiber, they're good for you. Keep you regular. You can take it on now. And their flavor is not too strong. Lentil soup, have you tried that? Lentil soup? But what kind? But what kind? There's so many different ways of preparing it. I've, my personal favorites are uh, Ethiopian style and Indian style. 
But that's also because I like food with a lot of um, condiments in it as well. Said you have done an amazing job at all your products. Nice. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Only the best. Trish said, is that shiny? This is Dom Top, which is our thick gel top coat. So you guys are 20 years. <laughs> and you've had your nails on for how long? And they still look pretty good, huh? So let's turn this hand upside down for a few seconds, let it self level out. And we're gonna cure them for a minute and a half in the Barbie darning hand. And the bubble gum gel is great for people that are nail biters, for people that want to use a sculpted nail but don't have a um, an apex to their nail. Their nails are pretty flat, the bubble gum gel will fill in that gap. Beautiful. So now we're going to bake this for a minute and a half inside the Barbie Darling Oven. Christina, do you like lentils? Yes. Do you like lentils? Do you make them with like spam or bacon or something like that? Bacon? Have you ever had them like African style or Indian style? But they're not, she doesn't, she's never had lentils. Split peas? Split peas? I've never had split peas. Or black eyed peas, I've never had black eyed peas. And I know a lot of people in the South eat black eyed peas for uh, New Year's. Yeah, it's like a tradition. Split pea soup? Isn't it like really bright green? Yeah. What does it taste like? That. But pea soup sounds like something you would eat at sweet tomatoes. I know. I never got a chance to eat at sweet tomatoes. Really? I always wanted to go. I'd never gone to sweet tomatoes. And the OG sweet tomatoes is in Orlando and when I go, or when I went last time, closed. As soon as you like driving out of the airport, there's a big old sweet tomatoes right there and it was closed. But surprisingly, Orlando, Florida is the birthplace of many franchise restaurants. Bye. So, do you know that Olive Garden is originally from Orlando, Florida? And so is um, Golden Corral. Yeah. Really? Gosh, I haven't been to Golden Corral in a long time. The last time I went to Golden Corral, there was a lady there and she was stealing steak and she got caught. <laughs> yeah. She had a purse, like, and she was like a big purse, like, like a big purse, you guys. And she had a plastic bag and she would go and get steak and put them inside the bag. And then they, they were like, why is such a small woman? Because she was pretty small, like a small frame. I think she was like, I want to say Southeast Asian. And uh, they were like, how can she eat so much meat? <laughs> she was stealing it. But they like they didn't uh, do it on the first time. They said that she had been doing it for a long time. So they wanted to make sure they had evidence to make sure that she was, you know, they could show it to her and be like, stop stealing steak. She was like, I got steak for the week. Every day, everybody. <laughs> How embarrassing though, huh? <laughs> oh, and then like meat after a few days is gonna get all dry. Yeah. But she don't care. <laughs> um, she's like, I'm gonna get this steak every day. Her husband has steak every day. All dry. <laughs> she's like shaking my head. How embarrassing to be caught stealing steak. I should have. At Golden Corral. Everyone's gonna know. That's funny. <laughs> and then I remember um, a long, long time ago, when my mom had her beauty shop, one of the ladies that worked there part time was uh, she worked at the uh, school cafeteria. And like after she would be done working at the school cafeteria, she would go over to work at the beauty salon and she would take us like the leftover lunches. Really? So I remember eating like school pizzas and. Yes. <laughs> And school food has like a very particular taste to it. Yeah. I wonder if it's the same as prison food. I wouldn't be surprised. Any hope Mike can get 
Um, so we exper experimented with black ombre and it doesn't come out very good. So that's why we never uh, mass produce black ombre nails because it, it doesn't look very good when you try to uh, mass produce it. So unfortunately, it's we tried it. So now, we're going to take one of our little Nexi Wet Wipes, multi-use products, and we're going to remove the excess dust and the oil. Now you have a big top. And there we have it. So now comes your job. You have to pick a winner for today's video. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Who is it gonna be? Merliana Vasquez. Merliana Vasquez, do you live in America? Hello, hello. Thank you. She said yes. Yeah. Yes, where do you live, love? Puerto Rico. Oh, Puerto Rico. Big shout out to La Isla del Encanto. So, mi amor, tienes 24 horas para mandar un mensaje a info at enocatour.com and let them know you're today's winner and we're going to send you out a little prize. So we use the same uh, post office for Puerto Rico's part of America. So you got 24 hours to send us an email and we're going to get you out a little prize. And that's going to be our wrap for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Super fun, super fast, super quick, and beautiful. And what can I say? I love you guys so, so much. Stay safe, stay out of trouble, and I'll see you guys in the next live video. Bye, everybody.